Welcome to a demonstration of the video review lessons by PPI for the mechanical PE exam in HVAC and refrigeration. There are 13 video lessons on topics that are covered in the HVAC exam. Each lesson is an audio-visual presentation like you're seeing now, except it's in full color and has animations. After we talk to you in the presentation, there are problems that you can solve and solutions are nearby. The topics that we cover in the lessons are all prescribed in the NICES format for the new HVAC and refrigeration exam. Every topic is covered in our video review presentation. We'll discuss fluid mechanics. In fact, there are four sessions in fluid mechanics, starting with very simple concepts, but rapidly moving on to friction, piping systems, pumps, and we'll talk about air, static pressures, fan horsepower, affinity laws. In every lesson, I'm going to refer to the material that is similar to our lesson in the MERM handbook. I'll identify them by chapters, I'll identify them by appendices, and equation numbers. For example, thermodynamics is an important part of HVAC, and we do a lot of lessons in thermodynamics. But when you go to the MERM manual, it turns out that there is way more thermodynamics in that handbook than we'll ever need for this test. So not only do I show you where you should be studying in the MERM manual, I'll show you where you shouldn't be studying and I'll cut this manual down to one tenth its size. I'm going to show you the easy ways to do things. For example, in refrigeration, I can show you how to solve every problem that is on a PE exam in refrigeration in about 10 minutes using the pressure enthalpy graph and a one, two, three, four step approach to it. Yes, we're gonna look at heat transfer and load calculations. Psychometrics is an important part of the PE exam. We'll look at the HVAC system and describe how to use the psychometric chart to solve almost all of the problems dealing with air side components. You know, it's interesting that too many exam candidates use old fashioned equations to solve psychometric problems. Willis Carrier, a hundred years ago, showed us how to do it without heavy math, straightforward, and conceptually easy to understand. I'll show you that method. We're gonna do a little chemistry, combustion, stoichiometry. And finally, economics is an important part of the PE exam. And if you think ex economics is a fly by the seat of your pants topic, you're wrong. There is a formal approach. There is an interesting approach the power of the parentheses, and I'm going to show you that during the lessons. Once we get done with our discussion, and I don't go into too much theory, I go directly to problem solving. I'll turn you over to a bunch of problems that I've created for you to try, and the solutions will not be far away. So, this is a great help for you to pass the PE exam. Give us a try. I hope to see you in class.